Unfortunately, the government's uh, schemes, many of the government schemes, even in the, the remotest places in the, in the country today, are not really helping a large number of people. So why are they not? Because people do not have true freedom or true ability to choose what they want because they don't even know what exists of China. Or they don't have access to the information of China. Youth in many parts of the country are addicted, addicted to many things. Unfortunately, the youth in, in the worst, worst Naxal or Maoist affected regions in the country, many of the youth are affected by some weird ideologies. So the, the, that's, that's one of the addiction itself. Secondly, the youth are also addicted to either alcohol, drugs, or but many of these unwanted things, many youth come into this country. Thankfully, it is not, a, not as big as it, 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 it is in many places, but it is still uh, alarming to some extent. True education, the way it is delivered today, or the way it is made available to people today, is pathetic. If you go to the places like Bihar, Jharkhand, Uttar Pradesh, the North East, the kind of education or the kind of quality of education is so pathetic that you will realize that you know you, if you go into even you know, even a place like uh, 100 kilometers from Ranchi, which is Ranchi is a just a but if you go 100 kilometers away, the education is really bad. So people don't have access to good teachers, a good system that works, or access to buses to travel to some of the best good colleges and schools. So lack of these basic facilities, or what we consider a basic right, is completely absent. One of the things that India can do to alleviate poverty is to provide quality education, quality knowledge, quality access to the most important things that are, that are relevant for the people. Giving quality education itself and making it available, which is in today's world, it's easy to set up an internet in the classrooms uh, uh, and to monitor those classes, monitor and make it available for everybody as possible. Now, can the government's policies provide, you know, and make them uh, execute the model of making these classes and the, the quality of education uh, to every student possible, definitely is possible, and, the, and, and our country can do it. Also, making quality infrastructure like the, the access to uh, access to facilities, access to uh, transport itself can change the dynamics of many of these. What is